Yo, what's up guys? My name is First Chance and I asked you guys like about a week ago. Okay, let me stop. But yeah, about a week ago I asked you guys to ask me some questions because I wanted to do a Q&A today. So you guys commented some questions. It wasn't really too many. It was a good amount though. It was a good amount. So I'm going to try to answer all of those questions in this video. Alright, first question. The first question we have here is from Jay's Plays. Um... It's actually a friend of mine. He does YouTube as well. I'm going to leave his link in the description. But, um, yeah, his question is, can I get, like, $100? LOL, just kidding. What's your most embarrassing moment in your life? First of all, no, you can't get $100. Yeah, I know you were joking, but, yeah, you can't get $100. Because, you know, I'm broke, and, yeah, that's it. But, um, the most embarrassing moment in my life? Mmm. Okay, now that I think about it, there was this one time, like when I was in 8th grade, I was getting home from school, right? And me and my mom, we got to the house like at the same time. And she was in the front yard, I was in the backyard because my bus stop was behind my house. So I had to like walk from my bus stop to my house and I normally go like through the back door or whatever, right? And normally it will be unlocked for me to go through there. And this time it was locked and I did not know that my mom was in the front yard and she had got out of her car and she was about to go to the front door and I just yelled the S word like as loud as I could you know because the door was locked and I couldn't get in the house so I was like come on work I was like crap I didn't say crap but I said the S word you know I don't use profanity but back then, I used to, you know? Yeah, that probably had to be like the most embarrassing moment, I guess. Had to be. Alright, next question. When you're making your gameplay, do you... Does, do your mic pick up any gameplay in the background? Actually, normally I try to keep my TV muted. Um, either that or I'll have like some headphones plugged into the TV. And I'll have like the sound going through my headphones and I'll have the volume low so that it doesn't echo out with my headphones but recently my headphones have started like acting stupid well they haven't been acting stupid I lost the auxiliary cord for them so yeah it's my fault that I don't have any headphones now but luckily um like two days ago my friend he was like yo I got some headphones you can use I mean like you can have them I was like oh thanks man cause you know before I had already like borrowed them for like a few days and he was like yo you can have these I got some new ones that are better I was like oh so you just give me the worst ones I'm joking but yeah I mean I still appreciate it though they're like earbuds but I mean at least it's something at least I can listen to music like while I'm on the bus and like at school and stuff next question is by Adrian Lopez this isn't a question I was never here. You never seen me. Okay, y'all never saw that? Okay, um, next question. The Wet Juiced. Um, he actually watches my live stream. Shout out to you, bruh. That's what's up. Okay, um, cool intro indeed. Glad I'm a subscriber. Here's my question. When you started YouTube, did it feel weird to talk to a camera? And what video software do you use? Keep up the good work. Well, thank you, sir. But, um... When I first started YouTube, I didn't even like half a camera. Like, I started like, I started doing gameplay like when I first started. Like my when I first started, my first video was really some crap. And yes, I did feel weird talking into a microphone because it felt like I wasn't talking to anybody. But yeah, over time you get used to it. You know, it just feels weird when you first starting. It takes like a few weeks, maybe a month to get to it. Yeah, it takes like a month, maybe month and a half maybe two months to get to get used to it you know and yeah I mean and then his other question was and what video software do you use um, when I edit my videos um, I use two softwares one of them which is what I started off with um, I use Windows Live Movie Maker um, it's okay for like beginners and stuff it's free you can download that for free um, that's what I've been using like since the very beginning. I still use it, but I don't use it for like everything, you know. And um, the second one I use, I use Camtasia Studio 8. 
you're supposed to pay for that, but you know, I got it for free. Yeah, I'm not supposed to do that. Yeah, but the next question from the Goofuses, he also watches my stream. Shout out to you, bruh. Alright, and his question is, what is your stance on YouTube Red? I just feel like YouTube Red, like, basically, when most people pay for it, they're like, oh, I can get YouTube Red and not have to watch advertisements before my videos, even though you can skip most of them, you know? But every now and then you have some that you can't skip. Also, they have the um, YouTube Music app that you can get now. And with that, you can um, you can like stream music and stuff like real easy. But you can't lock your phone screen when you do it. But if you have YouTube Red, you can do it though. You know, because they're trying to really promote YouTube Red for some reason. I don't know why they're trying so hard. Next question, which really isn't a question by activity raw she got cake for days i know what you talk about bro you talking about that talking about that song i got you bro i got you i like that song she got cake for days got bands all along the play baby girl watch what you say put that cake in my face i'm like she got cake though cake though she got cake though look how it's moving i'm swerving up in the corners i'm getting to it fans don't want the one fans don't want the one moolah touch my get your top pop on my shoe top all right the next question is by tress elvis reviews um he says my question is will you play with me pause and then he put hashtag fresh change q a thank you for the hashtag though that's what's up you know that's cool but um I try to. Pl I'm gonna try to play games with my subscribers in the future, um, cause I have Steam on my computer, but I want to make sure um, I don't play on my laptop because my laptop is kind of crappy. I've had it for like a year and some change now, and yeah, it, it's not fit for YouTube. It's like on its last leg. I had to get it repaired once for sixty dollars. Okay, but um, last question is by Foodie Fan or Footy fan who is your inspiration to do YouTube um, my inspiration was this guy named Kevin LaShawn that's his channel now you might know him as either expert thief or I sexy or I sexy TV cuz he had three channels his main channel was I sexy he had a vlog channel um, called I sexy TV and he has a gaming channel called expert thief he stopped uploading on the I sexy TV channel and the Expert Thief channel, he recently stopped uploading on that one and now he uploads all his videos, all of them, on his other channel, like his main channel, which was iSexy, but he changed his name to Kevin LaShawn because he felt like it was more original and stuff. So yeah, that, that was the guy who inspired me to do YouTube. I remember watching his videos like back when I was in sixth grade and I was like, yo, that looks so fun. Yo, I really want to do YouTube. That looks so cool. You know, so I was like, yo, let me get a video camera and a laptop so I can really get this YouTube thing going. You know, because I want to do this. I want, I want to do this as my job. I still want to do it as my job. That's why I do YouTube today. I want to do it as my job. And, you know, I don't, I don't even need my phone no more. Um, that was like all the freaking questions. But, yeah, I was like... I really want to do YouTube, that looks so fun. So then at Christmas, I get a crappy laptop and a camera that I don't even know how to use. I don't even know how to cut it on, like, really though. And I still have the equipment, I still have the equipment. I can show you guys, like, right now. All right, guys, so after, like, two or three minutes from, like, looking through my room, I have found my old equipment that I have held on to for all of these years. Yeah, this is the freaking laptop that I got. Like, like really though? Look at it compared to the size of my own my um uh, my actual laptop. Like the one I use for YouTube. Look at the size of that one. Look at the size of that one. Okay, okay. There you go. There you go. See that? Now here is this one. Look at that. It, it's not even the size of the screen. It's like, look look at that. It's, it's terrible. And then when you open it. What am I supposed to do with that? Like, what kind of crap is this? Does it even cut on anymore? See, it don't even cut on anymore. Look at that. And it's a freaking Sylvania laptop. Like, what kind of crap is that? 
Has he even heard of that before? And look at like the mouse pad. Look how small that thing is. Like my finger, it takes like three fingers to fill it up. Look at that. Three fingers to fill up the whole mouse pad. Look at that. And you got right click and left click. No crap. Right click and left click. See that? I don't even. This is this is terrible. That's terrible. All right, but the camera that I had, which is like, hold on, let me see. Uh. It's almost the size of the camera that I have now. It's almost the size. Look at this. And you got a freaking... Like, what kind of crap is that? Look at the back of it. There's no buttons on it. What are you supposed to do? There's one button. Look at this. It's one button. What am I supposed to do with that? And then there's a button up here. I'm, I don't know what this is supposed to do. How am I supposed to use this? I don't know how to cut it on. Like, you see, I, I pressed both of the buttons, right? Neither of them cut the camera on, so I don't even know which one cuts the camera on. I don't even know how to use this camera. Like, it's been, like, five years. I still don't know how to use this thing. Like, nigga, come on, man. God, I don't know how to use this thing. God, who freaking designed this? This is a Vivitar camera. It's actually the same brand as my, um... It's my camera stand, my tripod, because my tripod is a Vivitar tripod. So, like, is there specialty, like, tripods? Because it can't be cameras, because this is terrible. Like, I'm pretty sure they fi they spent, like, a dollar, maybe five dollars on that camera. Possibly ten. Possibly. There's a small chance that they spent ten dollars on that. But, yeah, it's, it's not the price that matters. It's the quality and if you know how to freaking use it but um yeah that's pretty much it guys thank you guys for asking me questions and stuff i'm gonna try to do a reading comments video every week every friday i want to do a reading your comments video so feel free to comment all types of weird comments and crap on this video right here and i'll read all of your comments in next friday's video and yeah with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed this video and yeah, be sure to leave a like if you liked it, subscribe if you already haven't, comment for next week's video, and for fun, because I reply to comments anyways, and keep it fresh everybody. Stop!